So let's talk about the, the animals themselves. Can you tell us a little bit as a judge uh, in the ring what you're looking for in the whole animal? Absolutely. So when the alpacas come into the show ring, we're looking at them in both conformation and in their fiber qualities. Conformation being really important because that's the form and function of the alpaca. We want to grow the best quality fiber across the frame of the alpaca, but we need the alpaca to be well grown out and healthy and be fit for function. We always refer to that as the term. When we say that, we're looking at all the traits that allow the alpaca to be healthy as it is developing. A good jaw alignment, nice and strong and straight in its top line and overall balance. That's gonna give the alpaca the optimum over the years as it is maturing out, producing offspring and producing fiber as well, because we have that expectation of obviously both things um, in each individual animal. And, and so also as an expert in both breeding and husbandry, can you tell us about how to achieve that high fiber quality that you were just talking about? Absolutely. So this is something that starts way, way before you even make the breeding decision. So with that being said, um, the female needs to be in her optimum condition because she is going to be bred back and she also has the crea at her side, which she is nursing. As we go through the gestation of the alpaca in utero, critical that they're getting good nutrition to develop out the follicles and taking the actual genetic base of that animal and really giving them the best opportunity to, to express the characteristics within each of those fiber traits and also their frame. The mother then will go forward and birth. Um, we want to make sure that she is very healthy so that when she has given birth to the crea, the crea has the optimum with the colostrum. She has good immunity um, transfer, passive transfer to the crea, and that gives the crea the start in life and as it continues to nurse, um, usually with alpacas, they are going to stay on the mother until about six months. Sometimes we wean them earlier if they're bigger, but generally six months. And we want to make sure that the mother then has the optimum nutrition and you know, body score to be able to support herself and the career.